everyone, how are you doing today? We've got a new upgrade here because we are a serious channel. <laughs> We're a big production, so we got a new microphone, and it's the. Uh, we also have the GoPro uh, mod kit, so we got that on there, trying to improve the sound quality a little bit. Let me know if it sounds a little bit better. I was listening to our video last week. I'll put a link in the description, and we had. I could hear the. I had my headphones when I was listening to it. I could hear the uh, the boat engine in the background. So we went ahead and cut the engine off right now. So the engine off it's nice and quiet out here it's gonna be a nice day today is Saturday I don't know about for you but it's been a long week I think this week has probably been the longest week uh, for us so we're just glad to be out here on the water we're gonna be making a double header back to back days we're going out today and then we're gonna go out tomorrow Easter Sunday we're gonna have uh, Jackson with us we're gonna go to Egmont at least that's the plan as long as the weather cooperates but today we're gonna go to Shell Key we're gonna be going a different way though we're gonna try a different way where we haven't gone so we're going to explore a little bit and we've already checked it out on google maps there's also an active captain we kind of have the path planned out looks like it's gonna be a nice ride we're gonna go through uh, Tierra Verde we'll show up on the north side of Shell Key and it's just because where the the wind is coming this should be a nice nice day for us uh, so check out the other video that we did we went out to uh, out to Fort DeSoto there was nobody around nice and private that that's why if you're moving to Florida or you live in Florida this is why you need to have a boat so check out that video yeah we're uh, we're just doing what we do <laughs> we come out here pretty much every chance we get we're out on the water that makes us happy we're gonna go hang out at Shell Key we got our new video set up here we're trying to improve the sound quality so this looks pretty slick babe so hopefully that that makes a difference a little improvements here and there and we will see you what on the island we'll see you on the island see you on the island man <laughs> Well, the tide's coming in. So these people, they came too close to the shore, bow first, which I wouldn't have done, but now they're they're stuck on the bottom. And instead of helping them, we're recording them. That's <laughs> that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> Y'all need any help over there? No, you guys got it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Kim, go help them. <laughs> Yeah, they're going to be all right. Yeah, the water here, we're on the north side of Shell Key. It's deep. It's like five feet, all, almost all the way up until it's not, you know, and then it's like, it, it gets, it's deep pretty much around the entire Shell Key. Which is not typical, in, I, I feel like, in Florida, right? Like most of the beaches we go to, it's shallow for a long ways. I mean, you could, you could walk out a quarter of a mile. <laughs> Yeah, Fort DeSoto is like that. But Shell Key, it gets... Down in the Keys, too. Like... Yeah. So now they're just... He's just getting a little workout. A little... <laughs> what was, was that? A little CrossFit? A little, a little, a little CrossFit? A little CrossFit. <laughs> this guy, he's like, ah, forget it. All right, so they're... Uh, they're, they're figuring it out. They're, they got to figure it out. Cheers. Hmm. This is a nice location. We've been here before. We, we, we've been here once last year. Look at the sailboats! There's a bunch of them! Oh yeah. It was really what? deep all through there, so if, if... I don't know where they're coming from, but... Um, probably going somewhere exotic, though. No, probably, probably just going out into the bay. Going, <laughs> Going out. Well, that's the Gulf out there. Gulf. So, so I'm thinking they're going to like the Bahamas or Jamaica. I think they got it figured out over there. They um. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, right? The shore is your anchor. Be there all day trying to get the thing all done. Hey, whatever. It's your... <laughs> so we're at North Side Shell Key, the Terra Verde. Pass of Grills right over there. This is a definitely a nice spot. We're probably gonna go on shore a little bit today. Gonna... I gotta look for shells. This is Shell Key. You can see the little tippy tip tip of um... the dog Cesar. Yeah. Yep, I can see it. All right, so they got Plan B here. They're like, look, this isn't working. Let's just reset and let's just. Give it hell. <laughs> <laughs> if you are new to boating and anchoring, and I get this out with my other videos, come out get, early. Come, come out, out early. Just... Get out here first. You want to be out here first because it's, it's like what time is it? It's like noon. Uh, it's, it's probably past noon. It's probably yeah, yeah. yeah. If you get out of here first, then you don't have to worry about this. You don't have to worry about people filming you. <laughs> I should bring out the megaphone. The megaphone. <laughs> you got this. You got this. All right. They just. All right. All right. They pin. All right. All right. A little early. Let's just. Let's just run over it and just. Uh, they know what they're doing. Get out here first. You get out here, you know, you know, 9 a.m. And then you could anchor. There's there will there, there won't be any boats here. And then you know, let everyone anchor around you. Oh yeah, there you go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 7.1. Seven feet. No, my my score 7.1. Oh, okay. One bite. Everyone knows the rules. <laughs> <laughs> One bite. Everyone. Uh, I think they did pretty good, actually. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go seven one on that. Oh yeah, just just throw the anchor on her. This <laughs> is. Oh, she sounds like she's from a. Uh, oh, look at that big old stingray right there. Look at One time when we were at Anna Maria, there was like thousands of them. That's so cool. So get get out here early, do your practicing yeah. because then you can do all the stuff. You're not gonna have people here, you know, watching you and recording you and all that. It just it, it makes it a little bit easier, you know. To I mean, this this really isn't that difficult but I, I can tell that these people they don't really have any experience um, uh, this could be a rental boat for all I know yeah there you go I would just, I would just turn it off. Yeah. So that guy, you know, that guy is doing a great job. You know, he's, he, he's actually, he's actually helping. The motor off. No, I, I would just, I would just, I would just cut it. I would go ahead. I would tie it off on that, on, on the, on the stern there, and then just let out your, your front anchor, and you're, and you're fine. But you know, that's, you know, that, that, that guy is doing a great thing. They're out here struggling. And uh, you know we could offer help. But. It's great that he's he's doing that. But it's 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 probably a rental boat, and you know honestly you, you probably need to. I don't I don't oh I don't know how what I feel about that. So if they're if they're if it's a rental, they they might not ever do this again. So the help is appreciated, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. Um, like for us, when people would help us, it was uh, it was like a little piggy bank, you know, like knowledge piggy bank. Correct. Correct. So, 
Yeah, just like I said. Yeah, there they go. So they, they so they they cut the engine. I would just, I would just cut it and then just you know just just adjust it. Just get in the water and and and, 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 and adjust it. It's that's so much easier. You know, cut the engine. They've got, they've got a front anchor out already. Yeah. In the valley so so then all you got to do is just like like I had you do. I said, hey, go ahead and you know you know would it, would it make you make it uh, tighter? So I had the the. the Right, make it tired that way we get the boat in this exact position that we want, so. It's a little deep. Right, I'm getting ready to hop in here. The biz is much nicer now. All right, let's take a look at these shells. Pretty cool, huh? One of those shells. You want me here? Let me hold. Let me hold your cup there. Just... I'm gonna try to catch it. We usually like to do a little bit of frisbee here on the beach. What's going on over there? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Shoot, you throw it so hard. <laughs> like that, nice and easy. There we go. Oh, oh that's my bad. Yeah, let's see here. Oh, that's way off. <laughs> doing too good on the frisbee throwing uh you had some good throws and that one i should have caught for sure so all right here you go you're drinking my drink since you spilled yours We're packing it up. This Kim here was taking a nice little nap here on the bow. You were probably sleeping for uh, maybe an hour. It, it was a it was it was it was probably it was a while. So she was sleeping and her umbrella fell off into the water. I had to go go out and get it. So saved her. The, the saved her parasol. Yeah, because you were sleeping for an hour. No, but that's 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 how you know we did things right. If you're falling asleep on the boat, I took a little nap, not as long as you, but it was good. Uh, you're not getting. Do you have to get the anchor yet? Let's let's uh we'll go ahead and get everything stowed and, and then uh, then we can pull that up. That, you cool with that? And then because uh, because once we pull that up, we're gonna start moving. Right, I hope you all like this video, and uh, we'll see y'all next one.